E. Welcome back, everybody. I'm Jade Monkey. We're back here in Rust, Rust Console Edition for the PlayStation, the Xbox, the Next Generations, and everything in between. And today we're talking about bunker base entrances that do currently work on Live and Testing Branch. We are on Builder's Paradise here, but we thought we'd show you another opening for a bunker base that's super OP that's working right now. And here it is. Okay, so here's the mock-up. It's very similar to another bunker base that we have. I might as well go ahead and link that now in the upper right-hand corner. We'll call it the bunker base exploit. Although this is more or less like, eh, it went through generations of this. Um, it will be patched as it is patched on PC, but it'll be in for a while. So expect this to be a nice bunker base that you'll be using in 2022. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so here's a mock-up. Here's, let's say this is the interior of the base. This is um, an entrance, as it were. So you've got a doorway here. I've got a ramp stopping you actually from getting in here. And if you don't have the bunker open, it looks like this. It will absolutely stop you. So if you want to get in, let's say you're online. Boop, beep, boop. Triangle spiral staircase. Come on, place it. There we go. Boom, that procedural top completes to the top of the twig and it enables you to enter. Also, what's really great about this is you can stick a shotgun trap on the top. And as you know, shotgun traps shoot through twig. And this will auto-complete this once this twig is gone. Boom. Capped off, you're good to go. And this ramp prevents anybody from getting in. And this door hides it nicely, too, as well, adding more protection. So you kind of got the general idea of this here. Uh, what's going to happen, uh, we're going to go ahead and show you how to do a mock-up of this over there. And you can add this to any base. Uh, you can mix and match all the different bunkers that we have done in the past um, and making it super, super OP. As you know, stability bunkers do kind of leave a, they don't kind of, they do, they leave raised elevation or raised uh, foundations, jeez, I cannot talk, like so, so it makes it a bit easy to find when there is a bunker base around or where to actually attack because you can, if you rock, walk around with a hammer, rock, rock, walk around with a hammer, you can see the raised elevations and then you kind of know where to strike, but with these, they're very low profile, uh, keeping the raiders guessing, which is what you want. Okay, so let's go over here and do the mock-up real quick so you guys can see how it's done and then try it over on Rust Console Edition. Yeah, yeah! Um, and yes, uh, we're on Builder's Paradise. I don't know if I said that earlier. This is testing branch. This still works over on Live Branch. And like I said, this will get patched out eventually, but it's going to be... You can still use it. Uh, it'll just be used a little bit different, if that makes any sense. So um, it's still going to be useful across the board. Okay, so what you want to do is just have a square like this. Uh, we'll make these metal so it's a bit easier for it to stand out. And let's say this is your entrance. But, oh, you know what? Let's do it here because this, this little guy is going to get in the way. And there's so many people next to us. Okay. Uh, let's just make this one a high quality so that's easier to stand out. Let's say this is going to be the entrance to your bunker. Boom, like so. Let's make that stone just for argument's sake. Now, what you want to do is you want to drop your spiral staircase. So I have two triangles here, just like the high quality. Right there in that pattern off to the side. And what you want to do is place it on the interior where it looks like... Let's see if I got it. Yeah where it's not the triangle in front of the door, but it's the one next to it, and it should auto-complete in front of the door just like that. Uh, leave it as twig, make sure it looks just like this, and then you know you did it right. Then you can upgrade it. Remember, after the cementing phase, I'm assuming most people know this, uh, you cannot demolish things, and that is on purpose. So be careful. Make sure this all works out for you before you commit, is what I'm saying. And then, again, what you're going to need is a half wall on top if you want this procedural top to actually complete. Wait, did I get that right? I feel like that. Yep, that was a low wall. It's like, that looks a little too small. It enables this procedural cap to finish on the top here, and it also enables you to place a shotgun trap. Now, what's going on here is these uh, top of the stairs, if you'll notice, this platform here that I'm standing on, this railing, uh, will move up accordingly. So that's why this works so well. Eventually, it'll work like the rooftops, and maybe I'm getting ahead of myself here, where uh, they have to be of the same material, and then we'll just have to make some slight variations on this. But like I said, this should be around for a long time, for a good chunk of the year, if my estimations are correct. So, uh, you know, use it the best you possibly can. Understand it, because bunker bases, ooh, man, especially if you're solo, I'll tell you what, there's something else. Okay, so see how we have a half wall there? We can just double check to make sure this autocomplete finishes. Again, back to the spiral staircase. Place it here in the back. Boom, you can walk right through. Clean. Let's go ahead and destroy this quickly because we are on Builder's Paradise. It's super scary. And right here, to prevent people from just crouching under the doorway, you're going to place a ramp. 
Uh, these are a little fickle as of early 2021 on Live Branch, but the next big patch should make this a lot easier. They're still quite fickle. Oh, I had it right there. Boom. So you want this touching the foundation and the ramp going up to the doorway so you cannot enter like so. And you should commit this to something beefier like, ah, uh, you could use stone, but I would recommend things like metal or high quality OP. And now we should be able to place a door there on the frame. And then see from the exterior, you can place the spiral staircase. Boom. Place it and you can walk right in. How great is that? Another bunker base that's working for Rust Console Edition, uh, for PlayStation 4, Xbox One, Next Generations, PS5, Xbox Series X. You know what I'm talking about. And uh, yeah, these are fantastic. We have another bunker base. I'm going to go ahead and link that now in the upper right-hand corner. That is currently working on Rust Console Edition. Uh, again, mix and match these bad boys. If you have access to Builder's Paradise, try these out. These are super, super awesome. Try them on your base on the next wipe. Why not, right? And uh, yeah, if you found this useful and helpful, be sure to drop a like. And if you're into it, drop that subscribe and turn on those notifications to all. And we'll see you guys in the next video slash live stream. All right, see you later. Bye.